Hi again. This is the second packet. This is a phallix. Giant little dude. The light's behind you. You're just casting shots. And Pierre. Still making sperm webs. And active as hell. Little freaking guy being an asshole today. Yeah, that's right, I said that on camera. Alright, let's hope he decides he doesn't want to bolt. <laughs> Maybe his back leg. Hey, see how long that leg is? See that shit? As you can see, he doesn't move very. Uh, as you can see, he doesn't move very well, but he's really freaking fast. We have movement. It's the wrong way, but we have movement. Come on, buddy, you can do it. Yeah, just keep tapping him on one side and he'll turn. There we go. Get in there. Then just carefully fold this over, and clap them over. Here. Oh, come on, bud. <laughs> Look at the size of him. Mm -hmm. It's just so funny. Yeah. Oh. Well, as you see, that didn't no, work. Don't, don't pull me. Oh. I'm not. Don't worry. As you see, it didn't work very well. Because there he is. <clears throat> He's um, in the wrong one. Yes. Uh, maybe we'll do Pierre first. Oh, first, we gotta get him out of here. <laughs> All right. Come on, bud. Not further down. Come on. Here comes. All right, that was fun and exciting. He's in there, finally. Thank God he doesn't do his freaking bolt session like he doesn't do his enclosure. We can kind of give you a kind of look at what. It was. This is was. We've had him in since he was since we got him. Yeah. When was that? Almost. Not even a year ago. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Probably like seven months. Yeah, that's what. That's what he was in. He wrapped up nicely. In at the end, he couldn't fit back into his hide, so he stood it on top and wrapped it up. Yep. <laughs> He's doing his thing over here. Yeah. There's probably a couple molds in there too. Hey, a cricket! Oh, nice. <laughs> All right. Looks like he didn't get that cricket. <laughs> All right. Well, I figured I'd show you that enclosure because they do some beautiful webbing. All right. Now, time for. Pure. The, the man. <laughs> See if he'll be as cooperative. Oops, sorry. He was getting his hair kicky on before, so. <laughs> Legs straight out. He knows where to go, direction that way. But, as you can see there, John, very beautiful. And I'll. We'll do a quick shot of the, the female. Please go straight. Oh, yeah. He's kicking again. Yeah, he's, he's gonna 
I'm very happy, man. Same thing, just fold it over. <laughs> He's kicking hairs all the way. <laughs> just keep on folding and I'll make sure there's enough room. But there we go. Pierre! <laughs> you might want to write labels on them just so they know which one's Felix and Pierre. I'll tell Amanda to look at the video. Oh, that wasn't good. <laughs> but here's the box. It's going to be shipped from Austin. I've used the rest of our styrofoam for this and all that. And I'm just going to go grab the light real quick. And we can take a quick look at uh, the big girl. I named her and I still can't pronounce her name properly. Yachiro. What she said. Yes, Sarah just Sarah just got some anoles. They're in there somewhere. Don't know if you'd be able to see them. <laughs> Alright, but we're still on the oh, turn. Oh, there's one. Oh, you, I don't know if you'd be able to make it out in the okay. video. To the sack. Oh, there he is. Look at his head's tilted. To the sack. 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 Yeah. Not what you people think. <laughs> yeah, we're still very unsure about this, seeing as it is our first sack and whether or not it's looking proper. It's kind of flat. She rolls it over a lot and lays on it. But it is down there. It's, it's actually the first time we've opened her enclosure since I watered her. She yeah, was... we've kind of left let her be. What's it been now? Almost almost a month, I think? Mm-hmm. Almost a month since she's laid the sack. I'm terrified of pulling it, seeing as how deep down she is and how, well, big she is. She's very aggressive. Uh, as most females are. Tarantulas, that is. But the sack's looking kind of flat. And... Uh, it's looking a little better than when, you know, there's a pile of vanilla pudding from what it looked like, <laughs> or tapioca, or whatever you want to call it, but, ooh, and quick up, our one, uh, regalis molted, you can't really see her, but, she is huge. pretty sure she's bigger than the Red Queen, you see, she is humongous, Male's still kicking around. He's still back there. Those late night drummings tiring him out. <laughs> I don't know what he's gonna do. But yeah, here's everything. Again. Sephiroth the bar oil has been uh very active. Oh, he's at the top. Yeah. And just gonna, yeah. You're right. And the is basically touched the enclosure and they're gone. But, anyways, battery's about to die as I can see, so we're shipping. That's the shipping stuff. A little update on the egg sack and all that business. And, uh, till next time.